Now they take it to the short side. AJ Lamb met with resistance. They'll have another go. Ioane. And look at the power of Akira Ioane. Christy peeled off to the short side, expecting a pass. Didn't come. Now the advantage goes the way of the Blues. Oh, Teddy Black, though, manages to get away from the attempted tackle. Eventually, the whistle blows. Good opening for the Blues. They look to do the same here. Or oh, Teddy Black puts the first one over, and the Blues lead after three and a half minutes by three to nil. Christie takes it back the other way, crunching onto it. Carly Tuioti now. Good you away to his fellow North and Robinson. Almost got his way through. Now Black floating one over the top. Here's Bryce Heave. Oh, he's big, he's strong, and he's over. Just did it with raw power. Well, that's twice James Turner's been drawn in field on defence. The first time was the Oteri Black kick. Moves it on now. Heave. Another ricochet and it's bounced up well for him. Bryce Heem. Oh, he skips through the tackle of Turner. He's got Robinson with him and he'll go in in the corner. Gore, I see it stay patient. Not five minutes ago where they weren't and the Blues, they hurt them. Well, they should have been having a line out, an attacking line out inside, well inside the Blues 22 if they had to remain patient and just thought about things. They're 8-0 down, but they're in the game. As a result of the reshuffle that's gone on, two lifelong friends. They'll enjoy that. Now the ball pops up nicely for Big Angus Bell, and he goes all the way to the line. <laughs> that didn't look like it. He burst away. Did Big Angus Bell pressure, and they do get some reward, Smithy. Yeah, well, Harry Johnson home started it with uh, a nice little run off to the left, which uh, created this very quick recycle. Floated down over halfway, AJ Lamb. And here is Sullivan again. This time, swings the pass away to him. Rico Ioane now looking to accelerate. Taken down in the tackle by Alex Newsom. Christy, oh, oh intercept! And he's away! Jake Gordon's going to score! And the Waratahs are right back in it! The Waratahs have got themselves back into this game big time. And who's the pressure on now? The underdogs... Uh are anything but in the last five minutes or so. They're in this game big time, that coaching staff. Well, easy conversion for Harrison. It's just a one-point game. And Gibson is there, so it looks like they'll drive it. Eklund comes in. Referee, I think, is playing advantage again here. They go to the line. They're over the line. And again, they look, and this time, the ball scored it. Missed out on only seconds ago. Yeah, good refereeing too from Brendan Pickerel. He didn't give it straight away. He got in there and he looked to see if the ball had been grounded this time over the line. He manages to pick his way between a couple of defenders. Now picking it up is Rico Ioane. And he'll go all the way. Rico Ioane the try. Blues stretch their lead. They were uh, playing under advantage, the Blues, because uh, that defensive line from the Waratahs was a judge to be offside. And there was just absolutely no one behind that breakdown there. Uh, and, of course, you've got to have some fringe defence. It was Turner that tried to get across to stop Rico Ioane, but he was gone. No number eight. Six. Blues might try and shunt this over. Well, the Waratahs were holding initially. Now they start to go into reverse. And a penalty try. numbers to the right if they want to go to the back line. Referee plays advantage again. Gordon, why oh no, leaves the forwards to it and they're in. They use the power instead and David Pordecki goes over for a well-deserved try. From there in support, not. Now Black moves it on. Fayani floating it wide. Bursting. Second of the game. Started to come to the four for the Blues, with uh, both Sam Nock and Papa Lee being heavily involved in that. A good determination. Oh, it's been picked off by Orteni. Back lock, it's a beautiful ball! Away to Bryce Heen, and he's going to have a hat-trick! 
so minutes and uh, he was the one that was going to be on the end of that pass but Oteri Black read it beautifully Rice, Bryce Heen finished it beautifully and Justin you summed it up beautifully because if ever the game was summed up in a nutshell there it was can't find his way past Robinson and here's a bit of space here now for James Turner puts the chip kick in oh he might have been blocked there What's the oh it's going to be a oh, no. oh he was in and he's lost it gets a bit of a roasting from the crowd too a man who's played so much rugby on this ground Sam Nock who was making the tackle which was not going to do anything because momentum was going to get wet in there but what it did do was put his hand in the vicinity of the ball and it dislodged the ball miraculously unfortunate for wet and here's not he's just trying to sort of make a tackle i guess in desperation but it wasn't going to be a try saving one unless he does that which is absolutely luck and fortune but also a bit of genius in it as well yeah they're going to take the tap put it into touch and the blues go back to the top of the table in Sky Super Rugby Trans Tasman. A second big win. They follow up their 50 to 3 thumping of the Rebels with a 48 to 21 win over the New South Wales Waratahs.